American millionaire freezes his body for 50 years, hoping for resurrection. James Bedford, a wealthy psychologist at the University of California, was diagnosed at 72 with kidney cancer that had spread to his lungs. The news shocked him and his family, as he had shown no signs of illness. Desperate for a cure, James pursued every option, but medical science offered no hope. As his condition worsened and death loomed, he discovered Dr. Robert Edinger's book, The Prospect of Immortality. Edinger, the father of cryonics, proposed freezing bodies to prevent decay, allowing for future revival. Grasping at this chance for a new life, James believed that freezing his body might one day lead to a cure for cancer. In 1967, he spent $4,200 on cryopreservation. After his death, doctors drained his blood and replaced it with a chemical to protect his organs before placing him in a dry ice container, then into a liquid nitrogen chamber. Initially stored in Phoenix, Arizona, James's body was later moved to California, but rising costs depleted his funds. His son took over, refilling the nitrogen at home until the body was transferred to the Alcor Life Extension Foundation in 1982. A 1991 inspection revealed signs of decay, discolored skin, collapsed nose, and brain damage caused by the cryoprotectant. James had hoped to be revived in 2017, but that day never came. Modern medicine still hasn't found a cure for cancer, leaving him in an endless frozen sleep.